welcome today is part 11 of the chapter binomial theorem for preparation of jee main advanced and for different state level joint entrance examination in this part we discuss few long type problems for preparation of the above uh, examinations first problem is 50 problem number 53 and it is if 1 upon root over 2x plus 1 into 1 plus root over of 2x plus 1 by 2 whole to the power n minus 1 minus root over of 2x plus 1 by 2 whole to the power n is equal to a0 plus a1x plus up to a6 x to the power 6 then find n Oh, sorry. Eta. Uh, bracket close. So the expression is one upon root over two x plus one into one plus root over two x plus one by two whole to the power n minus one minus root over two x plus one by two that whole to the power n. This is given as a0 plus a1x, a2x, x square up to a6, x to the power 6. Then what is n? Value of n, how much? Uh, it is clear that in that expansion, maximum power of x is 6. From there, we have to calculate value of n. Let us take 1 plus 2x plus 1 no actually let us take root over of 2x plus 1 is equal to y square then the expression become 1 upon y into 1 plus y to the by 2 to the power n minus 1 minus y by 2 whole to the power n is equal to that 2 to the power n from here and there also can be taken outside 1 upon 2 to the power n y into 1 plus y to the power n minus 1 minus y to the power n there are two binomials we can very easily expand them this is equal to 1 upon 2 to the power n into y into this one is 1 plus n c 1 into y plus n c 2 into y square this way up to n c n y to the power n minus this one is 1 then minus n c 1 y plus now n c 2 y square then minus n c 2 y cube and so on now you see 1 cancels 1 upon 2 to the power n n into y 
this one and that one is again plus nc1 y so two of that survives so two into nc1 y this will be cancelled because nc2 y square and minus nc2 y square will be cancelled next term is plus here nc3 y cube this is also nc3 y cube with positive sign sorry this is so plus nc3 y cube this way up to ncn y to the power n it is equal to 1 by 2 to the power n minus 1 1 2 cancels and that y will be cancelled with nc1 plus nc3 y square up to mcn y to the power n minus 1. Now given result the given information maximum power of x present is 6 x to the power 6 and we get here maximum power of n maximum power of y present here is n minus 1 but the relation between x and y is that x uh, y at 2x plus 1 is y square so root over 2x x maximum power of x is 6 here here maximum power of y must be at 1 so it is clear that maximum power of y must be 12 that is n minus 1 is equal to 12 so n is equal to 13 so value of n is 13 next Problem number now 54 and the problem is find the remainder when 7 to the power 7, this to the power 7, this to the power 7, this way 25 times. 7 to the power 7, this to the power 7, this to the power 7, this way they are 25 sevens in power then uh, when this is divided by 48 when this is divided by 48 find the remainder now it is a very interesting problem we know that any power of 7 is an odd integer how now 7 to the power 1 is 7, 7 to the power 2 is 7 into 7 that is 49. In unit position it is 9 that is odd. 7 cube it is equal to 3 into that. In unit position 
again 7. 7 to the power 4. 7 to the power 4 is 4, 9. 7 into that, that is 49. And before that, some integers are there. So, in odd positions, uh, sorry, in unit positions, the number is either 7 or 9 or 7 or 9 or 7 or 9. So, it is an odd integer. So, this to the power, this 7 to the power that, it is a very big number, but we, uh, it is, we understand that it is an odd integer. So, this can be written as, this is equal to 7 to the power 2n plus 1. Because for any value of integral value of n, positive integral value of n, this is an odd integer. So this is this is equal to that. So this is equal to 7 into 7 to the power 2n. It is equal to 7 into 7 square, that is 49 to the power n. So that it is equal to 7 into 1 plus 48 whole to the power n. It is equal to 7 into 1 plus nc1 into 48 plus nc2 into 48 square plus nc3 into 48 cube and so on. So that it is clear that all terms excepting the first one it is either 48 or its multiple. So this is whole thing after that it is divisible by 7 and uh, it's divisible by 48. So this part is not divisible by 48. After that all terms are divisible by 48. So the remainder when it is divided by 48, the remainder is only this one, that is 7 into 1, that is 7. So remainder is 7. Next. Fifty five Problem number fifty five. Find the term of x plus one by x to the power two by three minus x to the power one by three plus one. This is one by three minus x minus 1 by x minus x to the power half whole to the power 10. Find the term of that which is independent of x. So let us first simplify this term and that term in simplest possible way. It is, first one is x to the power 1 by 3 whole cube x plus 1 by x to the power 2 by 3 minus x to the power 1 by 3 plus 1. It is equal to x to the power 1 by 3 plus 1 into x to the power 2 by 3 minus x to the power 1 by 3 plus 1 by x to the power 2 by 3 minus x to the power 1 by 3 plus 1. Now this factor, this term cancels with that factor. So it is equal to simply x to the power 1 by 3 plus 1. That is about the first term. The second one, it is x minus 1 by 
x minus x to the power half. It is equal to x to the power half whole square minus 1. by x to the power half taking common x to the power half minus 1 so that it is equal to x to the power half minus 1 into x to the power half plus 1 by x to the power half into x to the power half minus 1 clearly this factor cancels with that factor and the thing left is this by that that is 1 plus 1 by that that is x to the power minus half so the given expression is this minus that this means that that is x to the power 1 by 3 plus 1 minus 1 plus x to the power minus half this whole to the power 10 now this one minus 1 and that plus 1 cancels so that thing that x to the power 1 by 3 minus x to the power minus half whole to the power 10 so this is simplified value of that now to find a which term contains which term is independent of x and find the term so suppose that t r plus 1 is free of x calculate t r plus 1 is equal to n c r x to the power 1 by 3 whole to the power n minus r into minus x to the power minus half whole to the power r it is equal to minus 1 to the power r this negative then n c r this one then power of x x to the power n minus r by 3 n minus r by 3 into x to the power minus r by 2 now we assume that this is independent of x so this must be 0 that is that is we get n by n minus r by 3 minus r by 2 is equal to 0 that is adding them 6 2n minus 2r minus 3r Oh, n, I think. <laughs> oh, it is actually uh, power was 10. Power, given power is 10. So that uh, 2 into n means 20. Sorry, very sorry. So that, uh, that is equal to 0. That, so that we must have 20 minus 5r is equal to 0. So we get r is equal to so fifth term is independent of x and the term is uh, to get the independent of x term we have to put r is equal to 4 over there so t5 independent of this is n means 10 c4 into this into that 
it will vanish. Actually, this one will vanish. So that answer is this. So 10 C4 means factorial 10 by factorial 4 into factorial of 6. So that it is equal to 10 into 9 into 8 into 7 into factorial 6 by this is 4, 3, 2 into 1 into factorial 6 is that. So factorial 6 cancels, 8 cancels, 3 with that. So it is 10 into 3 into 7. So 210 is coefficient of that expansion which is independent of x. Okay, next. Next problem is problem number 56 and the problem is 3rd term of 2 to the power x plus 1 by 4 to the power x whole to the power n is 7 times the second term of oh. this is a binomial given that its third term that is t3 is equal to 7 times t2. First information and it sum of and sum of coefficient of second term plus third term is equal to 36. Then to find n and x. So there are two informations and from there two unknowns n and x are there. We have to find n and x. The, from this one coefficient of t2 and t3 sum is 36. That means we, we must have n c1 coefficient of second term and this contains x, this contains also x. So this is coefficient of t2 and coefficient of p3 is n c2 that is equal to 36. That means n plus 1 c2 is equal to 36. It means uh, nc2 is n into n plus 1 divided by, that is actually it is equal to factorial of n plus 1 by factorial 2 into factorial of n plus 1 minus 2 is equal to 36. That is we get factorial of n plus 1 by 2. 2 can be multiplied with that. So it is equal to factorial of n minus 1 is equal to 2 into that. That is 72. Now few factors will be cancelled from this and that. In numerator it left n plus 1 into n is equal to 72, which is nothing but a 9 into 8. So from there, very clear that this is two co consecutive integers. This is also two consecutive integers. So clearly, n is equal to 8. I get one answer, value of n. So n is equal to 8. Uh, 
for getting value of x first information is sufficient t2 t2 means nc1 into 2 to the power x whole to the power n minus 1 into 1 by 4 to the power x whole to the power 1 is equal to 7 into t2 nc oh, oh, uh, t3 sorry this is t3 This is uh, this is power two is equal to seven times t two n c one into two to to the power x whole to the power n minus one into one by four to the power x whole to the power one n c two is simply n n minus one by 2. This and that will be cancelled leaving 2 to the power x to the power 1 in right hand side and this and that will leave here 1 by 4 to the power x. Thus, now n known n into n minus n is 8 so it is equal to, oh sorry, the 7 times t2, oh, 7 times t2, 7 into that, it is 8 into 7, 8 because n is 8 by 2 is, is equal to 7 into 2 to the power x into 4 to the power x, 7 cancels, so that 4 is equal to x to the 2 to the power x into 2 to the power 2x 2 to the power 3x and it is 4 means 2 to the power 2 so x is equal to uh, 2 by 3 and this is answer x is equal to 2 by 3 and oh, oh, some I have done some some mistakes. It would be negative. That's okay. If you try, when all calculations are okay, only only you check the calculation. It may be minus one by three. Okay, you please try to find the, where I have done mistake. Anyway, so let us stop today, and next day I'll take few more problems of long type long type one okay thank you